Hello, healthy people. Composting is a great way to reduce waste and create nutrient-rich soil for your garden or plants. If you're new to composting, it can seem a bit overwhelming. However, it's actually a very straightforward process that can be done easily at home. In this video, we'll provide an easy start guide for beginners on how to make compost at home. But before we get into it, don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below so you don't miss out on any of our natural remedies curated to improve your life. Step one, choose a composting method. There are several different composting methods to choose from, including traditional composting, vermicomposting, and bokashi composting. For beginners, traditional composting is the easiest and most popular method. Step two, find a location. Choose a location for your compost bin that is convenient and accessible. The area should be level, well-drained, and close to a water source. It's also important to make sure your compost bin is located away from your home to prevent any unpleasant odors. Step 3. Gather materials. The key to successful composting is having the right materials. You'll need a mix of brown and green materials. Brown materials include dry leaves, sawdust, and shredded newspaper, while green materials include food scraps, grass clippings, and coffee grounds. You'll also need a compost bin, a shovel or pitchfork, and water. Step four, layer the materials. To start composting, begin by layering your brown and green materials in your compost bin. Aim for a ratio of three parts brown to one part green. Water each layer as you go, but be careful not to make it too wet. Your compost pile should be moist, but not soggy. Step five, maintain the compost. Once you've started your compost pile, you'll need to maintain it. Turn the compost regularly with a shovel or pitchfork to aerate it and help it break down faster. Keep the compost moist by watering it when necessary. Avoid adding meat, dairy, or oily foods as they can attract pests and slow down the composting process. Step six, harvest the compost. After a few months, your compost will be ready to use. It should be dark, crumbly, and have an earthy smell. Use your compost to fertilize your garden or plants Simply add a layer of compost to the soil around your plants or mix it into your potting soil. By following these simple steps, beginners can create nutrient-rich soil for their plants while reducing waste. Remember, composting is a process that requires patience and regular maintenance, but with a little effort, you can create a healthy and sustainable garden while reducing your carbon footprint. Thank you for watching, and we hope you found this video super helpful. And as always, remember to live healthy, live happy, and know that you are appreciated. Until next time.